I feel nauseous, believe me Never had a lot of shit come easy Had to work hard, struggle just to be me And now, to demonstrate the speed and movement of the typical comet, I give you the remote powered mini comet! You're slipping, Neutron! Real comets have long, pretty tails, not little stumpy ones. Only when they're filtered through the spectral light of the sun, Vortex! Care to tell me how I get a giant hot ball of gaseous radioactivity into the classroom? Hello, children! Ah! Get it off me! Down, boy! Down! Uh, whose comet is this? <laughs> oh, that tickles! Oh, no! Oh, no! Not the face! Ah! And that concludes my presentation. Thank you. Mr. Neutron, you're lucky I'm in a good mood today. And do you know why I am? Because your mom packed your favorite lunch? Kara? Principal Willoughby's mom doesn't pack his lunch. He probably has his butler do it for him. Duh! Oh, did your butler rub your tummy when she put you on the school bus and tell you your lunch is made with love? Oh, stop talking! No, I'm happy because the Lindbergh School Chorus has been asked to sing at the opening of the town's new stadium. Oh, how exciting! Awesome! Now my singing talents can be revealed to the whole world! And apparently some other upstart band called Grey Star will be playing as well. Grey Star! Oh, Grey Star. Star! Oh my god, that is so cool. Now kids, quiet down. Shh, shh, shh. Thank you. The auditions for the chorus will begin after school today, as the stadium opening is only a few days away. <laughs> well, I hope to see everyone there. At least the talented ones. I'll be there. <laughs> Well, I have to get back to my lab and make preparations for my trip to Twonkus 3. Twonkus 3, the comet. You know, the comet that I have just been describing to the class? Uh... Ah! Okay, Sheen, I gotta go. Good luck at the chorus rehearsal. Right, like I'll need it. Besides, no one has been rejected from the Limburg chorus in 50 years. Jimmy Neutron in A Comet Cometh. Aha! According to my calculations, Twonkus 3 is finally coming into range! Looks a little unstable, but I can't wait to see what scientific samples I can bring back from up there. All I need to do now is find the parts I need to fix my rocket ship, and I can blast off. Hello, Jimmy. If you ever see the interact icon, move close to it and press the triangle button to see what happens. Do this now. Excellent, Jimmy. Other objects you can interact with are now in the control room. Try them out and meet me in the lab when you are finished. Ah, 
home sweet home. Where would a genius be without his lab? Now I need to find those parts. I wonder if I can find them in the lower levels. Okay, Jimmy. You can control the camera with the right analog stick. Move the right analog stick left or right to rotate the camera. Try this now. Sometimes you may want to position the camera directly behind you. Press the L1 button to do this. Go ahead and try, Jimmy. Excellent, Jimmy. Now follow me to the next lesson. You have activated a checkpoint. If you ever run out of health, you will return to the last checkpoint you have activated. You can collect objects when you walk over them. Pick up the object in front of you now. A gizmo piece! All right! Well done, Jimmy. If the object is an invention piece, it will be added to your inventory. Now, follow me. You will need to jump on different things throughout the game. If you press the X button once, you will do a normal jump. Press it a second time when you are in the air, and you will do a double jump. Jump now to reach the pickup. This gizmo piece will come in handy. You have found enough items to create an invention, Jimmy. Press the R1 button to bring up the inventor face. The inventor face has four categories, gizmos, inventions, super inventions, and blueprints. Gizmos require two objects. Inventions need three objects. Super inventions require four objects. Press the up or down directional buttons to change category, and press the X button to move across to the objects. Press the up or down directional buttons in each column to change available objects. Then press the X button to see if an invention has been created. If the pieces match up to create a new invention, it will be added to your inventory. You can see your current inventions in the hypercube. To access the hypercube, press a directional button. Once the hypercube is visible, use the directional buttons to scroll through your inventory. Select a gizmo or invention and press the X button to use it. Great job, Jimmy! Now explore the lab and follow me to see Goddard when you are ready. Atomic vomit! A super invention object! object. With this object, I could make an incredible super invention. Maybe Goddard can help you get that pickup, Jimmy. Mm -hmm. 
You have found a Goddard upgrade. When you pick it up, Goddard will have extra commands. They will be available from your hypercube. Keep an eye out for more upgrade packs. Why don't you try them out now? <laughs> Alright, this should help me out. If you can get something to weigh down the panel, the gate will stay open. Another invention piece for my inventory! You have found a blueprint, Jimmy. Blueprints are plans to show you how to create some inventions. Check your inventor face at any time to see your blueprints. This should make inventing easier. Good work, Jimmy. You have now completed all the tasks that you will need after you leave the lab. I may come back to teach you some extra abilities at a later stage. Super! An invention object! A super invention piece! Time to go outside! So, Jimmy, guess what? My folks said I could get a new pet as long as it doesn't set off my allergies. That's great, Carl. Uh huh. So, you want to come to the pet store and hold the animals up while I sniff them? Uh, sorry, Carl. I have a date with Twonkus 3. Twonkus 3? Yep. It's a comet that is entering Earth's orbit in... You can blow it out! Gotta run! 
Plunkus 3 is entering Earth's orbit in an hour! So, what I miss? Oh, Jimmy's needing a comet and I have to go sniff animals. And they say I'm the weird one. Well, guys, you gotta fly!